Mike is in big trouble. He's been out making purchases again. What a surprise, right? How unusual. Yep, works for cooking children. It's going to be delicious. Better settle down there, bucko. Okay, no smoke food for you for two weeks. <laughs> oh, you already got it. Yeah, smoker time, baby. If you're looking for some crazy, I'll tell you everybody's standing out of line for the water slide. I'm in the box. Reese is killing it over here. We should have got some pellets too, huh? I'm just oh. kidding. <laughs> got all this? You get any pellets? The hell? Really? Definitely got pellets. Hey, guys book. don't read instructions. Ever. Yes, you do. I always read the fun instructions. Always. No, you don't. You I look do. at them. You oh, look no. at the pictures. You don't read the words. No, Tell the to. truth, Reed. What's the we story were just with on the Lexington? USS Lexington the other day. Oh, because you were on we were the, the Lexington. The USS Lexington. Now we have the USS or the Lexington Grill. Smoker. It was. And and some people might say, No, we live in a bus. We don't have room for a smoker. But yeah, not do. Mike. You make, Mike would never say you that. You make room for for a smoker. That's what Mike's talking about. Right. You men, you're on the same page. You make room. Us women, we're gonna, we're like, Not what are page. you even thinking? Right. That's why we had that grill over there that we actually park on our bus as a pain in the ass. But it's worth it. But it's worth it for those steaks for those, and artichokes exactly. that you served Thank us the you. other night. Right. Which were delicious, by the way. Oh I'm not yet. The pellet smoker is like the cruise missile of cooking, barbecuing. There's already sand in it. Already? Oh, oh, the yeah. beach, it just gets in everything. See the pellets right there? There they are. Are they coming? They're the pellets. The pellets are coming. Right there. Can we fall in finally? From the pellets. Right. So now can you stop spinning? I should see something burn. <laughs> this is a great day for us pyromaniacs. All right, nice. show us the new smoker. It's so Joker. pretty. We're doing the burn in right now. Oh, look at that. Burn off the... Burn off all the impurities and oils and stuff oil. from the shipping. And we so we've got to do that for 30 oil. minutes. Oh, for 30 minutes? And then we can put in the rest of the stuff and start grilling. Sweet. All right, so it's going to be wonderful. Okay. Things have changed. It's a little dark out here. Good. Look at this. The corns. Where's the fish? Is it in there? Yeah. Oh my gosh, look at that. that oh up. my gosh. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Probably right falling apart. That is going to melt in your mouth. It is. Oh. Hey. Ow. Damn it. <laughs> I should grab a little piece. A little dip dip. Put your hand out. A little dip dip. Oh! Is it good? Yes. Awesome. Okay, let me show you what's right outside the front door of the bus. And this is what we do at night. 
naked into the water. Pretty much water. every yeah. night. <laughs> we I'm, sit I'm around in. the fire telling all oh, kinds of tall you. tales. I'm not looking at your junk. <laughs> it's a no, great I'm time. We're all, we're all guys, children. Oh, Come sorry. on. <laughs> Our friends are crazy, like but that's how we like them. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how was dinner, you guys? Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. We never got any more film of it after the corn started getting oh shut. Gosh. I know, like, the corn was flying. Exactly. I was like, who Dinner's has time so for awesome. a camera? Thanks to Mike for, it was delicious. Uh, thank you, Mike, for thanks. the amazing uh, the smoker. Thank okay. you guys for uh, catching dinner tonight. Yeah. Right? Uh, see, what is that? Uh, sand trout and, uh, sand trout and red. Red, red drum. Very delicious. Yeah. And corn of the cow. It was a good collaborative yeah. effort. Uh, it was. It was whole so good. Yeah. All right. So this is this is good night, everyone. Good night. Woo! <laughs> See you tomorrow for New Year's. Oh, yeah. That's right. Look at that. Mike's been at it again. Show him what you smoked today. Oh, bacon wrapped hot links. Make sure you show that this is not the grill it came off of. I know, huh? It actually came off the smoker over there. Where is it? Yeah, over there. Look at that. What a beauty. Oh, yeah. There it is. That's how the pro does it? Yep. And all of a sudden, camp got very quiet. <laughs> the smoke out of a lot to this. Damn. Yeah. Yeah. Smoked salsa, nummy, nummy. ladies and gentlemen. I approve. Fresh Delish. smoked vegetables. The fatty approves. Fresh salsa. <laughs> oh, did I show that on fatty camera? The we smoked a whole alcohol tray alcohol of fatty. tomatoes, onions, and garlic, peppers. Peppers. And garlic, yeah. They massacre pompano down there, man. They'll They're get like, like uh, 30 to 60 in a day. They're like Asian, but they, oh. they I, I think that was so down. many pompano. Awesome. So like their friends would tell them, hey man, we, we slayed it the other day at, you know, 8 Mile or whatever, wherever they go, and then they'll come out that day, the next day, and just do the same thing.
Um, seven and a half. Already? Yeah. Oh my gosh. And you've been living here at the beach for what, like five, no, like six months? I think six months. <laughs> yeah, it seems like forever, huh? Yeah. And how do you like it at the beach? You love it. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers no. to that, buddy. Cheers to that. Tremendous New Year's party last night. Reed was the first one up this morning, and he said when he came out here, it was just covered with trash, like just swirling in the wind from one end to the other. <laughs> we partied like a bunch of teenagers for New Year's Eve. <laughs> but the awning is down, and Reed is all packed up to go. They have to head back to Colorado. Boo! Stay in the wind in the sun some more. Right? I know you're gonna miss this wind and humidity. It's New Year's Day and we're having a very peaceful day. We've moved to a new location on a very quiet, peaceful bay, and the sun is going down. We have a beautiful sunset over here behind us. And there's Skylar! There's a perfect view. So, sunset on this side and the sea on this side. The very peaceful sea of the bay instead of those crazy crashing waves. I don't think we even really showed you how crazy the waves were at the last beach we were at because the wind was blowing so hard like you couldn't even hold the camera still in the wind. It was ridiculous. It's totally peaceful here by comparison.
Well guys, we're going fishing. Today's the day we're going fishing. We're going to a place called Indianola Fishing Marina, which is supposedly like the best place. If you guys didn't know, we just moved to Port, La uh, Port Lavaca on the Texas coast, which is beautiful over here. I mean, it's, I mean, look at this. This is like, it is like a paradise here. It's so nice, a little chilly this morning, but other, other overall, just a beautiful place to be. However, the one thing it hasn't been is a good fishing spot, like terrible. We haven't caught, not even a bite. Like it's been terrible out here and we've had poles in the water every day. So we're gonna go to a place that's rumored to be a great fishing spot. And you guys are coming along with us, so let's go. We just got here to the Indianola Fishing Marina. And this is what it looks like. They got a little shack right here. There's a little, like a tiny little marina over here. I don't know if you guys can see it there. Right over here, it gets pretty deep. Right in this channel right here. Everywhere else, all over Matagorda Bay, is like seven feet deep. And then there's a, a, a shipping channel that goes down 40 feet. Over here, it's actually deeper than the sh fishing channel. It's just a hole, just kind of right here. So we're hoping to catch some big fish coming out of that deep water today. We're gonna go in the tackle shop here and load up on all the things that Mike needs to fish. <laughs> all right, we're inside the uh, uh, Indianola Fishing Marina. Is that what this place is called? Yes, sir. All right, what's your name? Julia. Julia here helped us out. I got me a pair of fishing scissors. And they got some uh, basic tackle and stuff in here to get yourself uh, ink. You're gonna have to bring your own fishing pole or you can get one of these little guys right here. A little Zedco that you grew up on. So we're heading out there. We're gonna catch some fish today. I, I'm feeling it. Catch and cook, catch and cook. Oh my God, it looks like Man. Jay is into something enormous here. What is it? Black drum? Is it a black? Yeah. I wasn't watching when it splashed, but it Look feels, at his pole like one. bend away. See if we can get a glimpse of it here. Oh, you can kind of see it. Oh my God, it's enormous. It's like as big as a car. There he is. Oh my God, look at that thing. <laughs> Holy cow. Oh my God. A monster. You gotta be kidding me. That is a beast. That is like as big as your leg. This guy's pulling in another one right here. Holy That's cow. These are huge fish, man. Jay's over here working on his big gigantic fish. There you go. Got it, never mind, dude. Look at that thing. Oh, I got one, I got one. You can let it go. Oh. Okay. Oh my God, it's not kidding time. Thank you. You're now he just hooked into one. Something crazy is going on Dude, here. Some kind of like lunar anomaly. Clearly, I'm not gonna catch anything, but everybody else is having a great time fishing today. Catching, I'm just fishing. They're doing the catching. Good job, everybody. Take the rest of the day off. I'll take over from here. Finally got something. Not very big, whatever it is. No, I think he's gone now. Yep. I don't know, maybe. Unless he just likes swimming towards the dock when he gets hooked. No, there's something on there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Now he's fighting. Thing right? Yeah, I think it's gay. Yeah, I don't know how to pull this guy up. You should be able to do it with your mind. All right, wait right there. You need to settle down. We're trying to save your life. There you go. You got this. Good job, my yeah, friend. Cool. Whew. It sucks when you catch a fish that has like a defense mechanism, you know? I know. <laughs> you look Let's look in his mouth real fast. Okay, look at this guy right here. Look at his teeth. Oh my God. It's so like a little vampire. It's, it's a, I think, what do they call it? Sand trout? Yeah, sand trout. Sand trout. A yep. uh, little Skyler caught this guy just now. Only edible fish we've caught today, but he's going back. We're into something now. This one's fighting different than the last one was. Ah, uh, it better. We don't want another stingray. Right? 
Let him wear himself out, man. Oh, boom! There he is! Oh, that's a red? I, did I see a spot on there? That's a red. Yeah. Holy cow. Nice and steady. Walk over to the, to the trap. How do I take this out of the water? Just the same way you did the plaque? Uh, yeah, you just got to be careful. Look at that thing. Yeah. Holy All right, I'm going to set this down. Do it. All right, so I gotta grab. Hi, guys. Yeah, underneath. Oh, my friend. What? Ow. By the other side where the hook's not at. Yeah. I have a broken rib right now. That's why I'm. You want me to grab it for you? Would you? Yeah, no problem. All right. I got a skill. <laughs> We're going to weigh this guy. I think I do. Thank you for your help. I was drunk and, and pulled somebody on top of me and broke my rib. Did you get hooked? Oh. No, he didn't. <laughs> That's what I was just out. talking about earlier, too, man. Wow. Look at that Holy bad boy. Holy cow, man. Yeah, that's, that's a big red, huh? Man, it is a big red. We're going to weigh this thing out here, because it's this is a big, big red. Oh, 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 you're not going back. You're not going back. He's pretty big, so I don't know if it's holding. Oh. Twenty-two and three quarters. Yeah. Nice. You want to keep them? Up here, to put you. it up to the camera. Here. I just did. I just did that. Twenty-two. Yeah. Three-quarter beast mode. Yeah. All right. Way to go. Too big to eat, I guess. What I hear. They are edible, but yeah, they get. Woo! Yeah, if you want to get that, but heck nice yeah, man. Nice catch. Got one. That was a really big fish, man. That was awesome. <laughs> I think it's the biggest fish I've ever caught in my life, yeah. I think. That was a big fish. Whew. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my God. Hold on, buddy. Not, not two minutes after on. we just released our red, Skylar's into a beast. It's as big as he is, probably. There you go, buddy. There Look at go. him lean. There you go. Got it, dude. You got it. This is your fish, buddy. <laughs> I heard that thing swinging over here, dude. I was like, oh. What do you think, Skyler? <laughs> oh, oh. He's fighting back. He's getting. Oh, oh. Get closer. Get closer. Get closer. Get closer. Get closer. I don't want that line touching this. Okay. Do not let that line touch that. Three it's things. okay if it zings. You're wearing them out, dude. Just keep that. Keep that rod off that pole, okay? Oh! This is so great. This is so great. Look at the proud dad over here. Hell yeah, <laughs> so man. <stoked. laughs> That's another monster. Get off. Get you big boy. Got her reeled in. Another enormous oh. fish. What? Pull a little bit more, buddy. Pull a little bit more. Oh my god. There you go. Yeah. Another monster oh fish. Look, he's got a remora on him. Yeah. He's got a remora on him? Yeah. It's huge. I cannot believe I wheeled this in. Oh. Did you catch that? He yeah. did. Wow. That fish is as big as Bailey. you are. Can you hold him underneath there? Oh. Underneath? Yeah. <laughs> Get in front of my fingers, there you go. Pinch hard, as hard as you can, and set them on your knee. Tilt them up. Tilt them up. Ready? Wow. Oh. <laughs> 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 I want to go home. High five. <laughs> Say bye bye, fish. Bye bye. <laughs> That's awesome. Congratulations. <laughs> What are you doing, Skylar? I think it's a black drum or red drum. I'm going in this big fish. You're going to hit a big one? Uh-huh. Skylar is catching more fish than me today because he's a beast. Something huge. Is it a ray? It looks like a ray. I don't know. Oh, it's a big, oh no, it's a big old black drum. Oh, it's a big black drum, buddy. Oh, oh shoot, I got one too. Is he on it? 
He just pulled it down pretty hard, man. And your line's looking like it's getting a little bit loose. He might be on it. But oh, let's see what happens here. I think it's a stingray. That's my guess right now. And it's a stingray. <laughs> Look at that beast. What do you think, buddy? Can you hold it? Uh, no. What? You gonna try and hold that one? You're not going to hold that one up because it weighs more than you, huh? Ooh. I mean, sure. Why not? All right, pick him up for the camera, buddy. All right, let's, let's show him. Come on, dude. You got this. Go to go. Get him. Go, man. You got this. Harder. Now you just got to stand up. Oh. You did good though. All right. Hey, it's got a, That's here. a big fish. Uh, hurts, huh? Stand next oh. to him. Come here. Stand next to him. Look at that. That fish is half your size, half more than half your weight. <laughs> Very cool, huh, buddy? Good fish, buddy. Jesus, big fish. Well, you guys. I would say that was a good day fishing. We're, uh, we're gonna wrap it up here and go back to the bus and the RVs and stuff, but I wanna show you the sunset unfolding behind me because it's so beautiful. We caught so many fish here. There were so, it was just fun. The people here were cool. They were more than willing to share information with us. They weren't jerks or anything. And, uh, and everybody caught a fish and it was just so much fun to be out here fishing today. And it's definitely worth the $5 you spend to get into this place to come out here and throw your line because um, the fish banging out here and it's just awesome. And that's the biggest fish I ever caught. Like that, that was a 22 and three quarter pound red, red drum and it was a beast. But they say you wanna catch them like, you wanna keep them when they're like about 24 inches long. If they get too big, they start getting weird parasites and stuff like that. And so that's actually what we came out here to try to do was catch fish that were uh, edible so we could take them home. And honestly, every fish we caught was way too big to actually keep and, and take home. So I don't know if that's unfortunate or fortunate. I'm not even sure, but I'm unsad we're not taking any fish home to eat tonight. So anyway, uh, I'm, we're heading back to the bus and we'll see you there. You guys, look at Mike's so. no. fish. Night fishing. Wait, is this a red drum or this a black drum? This is a red drum. drum. This is a red? Yeah. Excellent. So we're going to let him go. He's too big to keep and eat. Oh, he's too big? Yeah, he's just too monstrous. I don't, I don't think he is. You think so? We no. should eat him? 